Hello YouTube, today I'm here with a new tutorial and in this video I'm going to show how to fix or enable Intel HD Graphics 630 with full acceleration on macOS High Sierra. So guys, before starting, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, then please go and subscribe to our channel and stay connected for latest updates. As I was receiving few requests to fix Intel HD Graphics 630 on macOS High Sierra, so here I am. So guys, let's start. As you can see currently I am running macOS High Sierra version 10.13.2 and the graphics is being recognized as Intel HD graphics 6307 MB only but this should be 1536 MB then only you will be able to get full acceleration to check the full acceleration the dock must be transparent as you can see the dock is not transparent yet so the full acceleration is not working yet so go to display tab and here is intel hd graphics 6307 megabytes only so let's fix this so all you need to do is download intel hd graphics 630 fix don't worry guys all download links are provided under video in the description so after downloading the file extract it to your desktop and open the zip file Now open the folder and as you can see here is the clover configurator and one readme file which includes the instruction to fix Intel HD graphics 630. So the first step is to mount your EFI partition. So open clover configurator. Now go to mount EFI and click on mount partition and this will mount your EFI partition so as you can see the EFI partition has been mounted here so close clover configurator close the folder now open the EFI partition open EFI folder then clover folder and one thing more make sure you have installed clover bootloader if you haven't installed clover bootloader then please install clover bootloader otherwise you won't be able to boot into your system some systems require the edited or a patched configure.plis file otherwise you won't be able to boot so if your system requires a patch configure.plist file then install the clover bootloader and replace the default configure.plist file with a patched one so as you can see i have already installed clover bootloader so no need to install so open your configure.plist file and go to the first section is the acpi then go to dsdt and here is the patches now click on plus button and you need to rename gfx0 to igpu so under comment type change gfx0 to igpu under find type 47465830 and under replace type 49475055 so it should be change gfx0 to igpu and under find it should be 47465830 and under replace it should be 54947505 then go to boot tab and check disable gfx firmware then go to devices tab and then fake id section and if there is any existing value then delete it and then type 0 into 59168086 so it should be 0 into 59168086 now go to graphics tab and select the checkbox inject intel and under ig platform id if there is any existing value then delete it and then type 0 into 59120000 so it should be 0 into 5912 and 4 times 0 and inject intel checkbox should be selected Close Clover Configurator, click on OK to save changes. Now after verifying all the changes, make sure to verify all the changes before you restart your system. Now close any other apps running. So close Clover Configurator and now you need to restart your system. Click on restart and make sure to uncheck this box reopen windows when logging back in and click on start and as you can see here is the global welcome screen so press enter to boot boot macOS from macintosh hd so select boot macOS from macintosh hd and press enter to boot Now 
enter your password so as you can see we are here on the desktop and the dock is transparent now earlier it was white only so let's check out the graphics select about this mac and wow the graphics is intel hd graphics 6301536 mb and go to display tab so here is the lg ips full hd display 21.5 inch running into 1920 into 1080p and the graphics is intel hd graphics 6301536 mb so the intel hd graphics 630 has been fixed and running with full acceleration with all the features enabled finally we have a full working intel hd graphics 630 working with full acceleration hope you like this video thanks for watching and don't forget to like share comment and subscribe for more updates stay connected have a great day